Good morning, Odell Dragons, and welcome to your WROP News. Today is Wednesday, January 15th, 2020. It is day six of week B, which is still our new rotation. Please note where you are going to Encore today. This will be the last day that the schedule is put in the news. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Your weather for today is a high of 63 degrees. It will be foggy this morning and cloudy this afternoon. Our wind will be nice and light, and our low tonight is 59. Now it's time to pick our Tuesday trivia winner. This week's question was a picture clue, and it was a picture of a whole bunch of kites. So your four-letter answer was the word kite. Yesterday was International Kite Day. So we did have some people that submitted some answers. We didn't have a lot yesterday, and that's okay. So let's see if we can pick a winner. All right. Congratulations, Miss Shepard's class. They figured out that it was Kite Day. Good job, Miss Shepard, and good luck to everyone else next week. For I Wonder Wednesday this week, I thought a good question would be how can we measure rainfall? because it has been raining a lot lately. So we can re measure rainfall with lots of different ways, but most often it is measured with something called a rain gauge. The professional rain gauges have two little buckets inside, and when one bucket is filled, it tips over, and then the other bucket starts filling and the rain gauge measures how many times each of those buckets is filled and it comes up with a calculation for the total amount of rain fallen. See if you can figure out how much rain we've been having lately. You can usually look it up on some various different weather sites. Happy measuring! Your lunch menu for today is orange chicken with rice, stuffed crust pizza, glazed carrots, steamed broccoli, good fortunes ice, and fresh fruit. Have a great lunch. Let's check in for another PBIS review with a how-to with Draco. It's time for how-tos with Draco and the Encore team. Today, we're looking at how to be respectful, responsible, and safe in the hallway. In the hallway, we should always have a buddy keep our hands off the walls, and use walking feet. Let's check in with Encore and see how they're doing. Coach Kirk is heading down the hallway outside of the library. Let's see what Draco thinks of that. Draco says no! That's because we should always have a buddy, we have to keep our hands off the walls, and we have to use walking feet. Sorry, Coach Kirk, that is not our best Dragon Pride behavior. Coach Kirk found Miss Stafford to walk down the hallway with her. But, oh, Miss Stafford looks a little distracted. Oh, man, let's see what Draco thinks of that one. Draco still says no. This time, Coach Kirk and Miss Stafford were together, so they had a buddy. But they were not keeping their hands off the walls, and they were not using walking feet. Let's hope they do better next time. Coach Kirk and Miss Stafford are walking down the hallway. Check them out. Let's see what Draco has to say about that try. Way to go! Draco approves. Coach Kirk and Miss Stafford had a buddy. They were keeping their hands off the walls, and they were using walking feet to go down the hallway. Check in tomorrow to see what else Draco and the Encore team are going to try to do with their best dragon pride. 